I want to demonstrate a new and easier way to tune the magnetism in a gate. Okay, so here's a magnet rotor, both same polarities. Okay, let me take this off. I have a magnet sticking onto a piece of steel, right? With just this magnet, it's attracted in the middle, but when you go out, it repels. You see that? It repels that gate there and repels the gate here, but when you're through the gate, it sticks. So it's not uniform. You could take a pipe or a steel casing and put it, try to get it in there. It doesn't want to go in. There's one there, there we go. Okay, now I enclosed the sides and I connected the magnetic path. Now this is sticking sticking and that repel went away there's no side repel now a little ahead uh, that might just be from the imbalance of the rotor but here that side repel is practically gone now if you want less you could pull the pipe back and put a spacer in there and now you'll get that repel zone again. So next, I'm wondering what happens if I cut a side of the pipe open, but leave the other side closed, and then close it. Would you get no repel on this side, but repel on this side? But anyway, a pipe over a magnet on a gate, close it all up. Now, I think I'm getting a little repel because this is a sloppy cut and there's gaps in there. You know, the magnetism's getting out. But if that's on there flush, there shouldn't be any repel because just a very slight amount for my gaps. But, but anyway, that's a good way to adjust the gate by sliding a pipe out to allow different interactions and saturation of the gate.